guys are the only team to have taken anything off Celtic this season. Do you think you can go and do that again this Saturday? Obviously we hope so. We no, we're not going into the game thinking negatively. So we're going to the game positive and hopefully come away with something. You know? And um, the gap between Celtic and the rest really seems to have grown this season. Sum up the, the size of the challenge you guys are facing. I mean, it's always a difficult challenge when you're away, to, especially away to Celtic. You know, the players they've got, obviously the fans, the stadium, everything. But you just got to concentrate on the game and hopefully we you know we'll play well on the day and hopefully they'll have enough to. And your, your draw last time came off the back of them getting thrashed by Barcelona. This time we've had a draw um, in Germany. Is that a good or a bad thing, do you think? I don't know. I don't know if it makes much difference. You know, they're still the same team, same 11 going out and playing. So it's one of them things. It could work either way. How do you feel that some teams have responded this season, particularly at Celtic Park, when Celtic have got their noses in front? I don't know. I haven't really concentrated much on it. Obviously, once they, yeah, we all know once they get ahead, it's makes the job you know, twice as difficult to get back at them, but obviously you can't do much else apart from go after them. Right, but obviously, I mean, you're one of these teams that, you know, it wasn't the case of here we go again, you know, you, when you played them up here, it was a case of, you know, having a go then. Yeah, I think you have to, I mean, there's no, there's, there's no point in going out and lying down, you need to go and have a, have a fight and get on the ball and hopefully play. How much do you think experience comes into it, I think, the likes of say, like the Ross Japers, Gary Warrens, people like that, who have played Celtic before in the past. And, you know, there are several in the squad who have been through the mill before playing against them. Yeah, there's a, obviously there's a lot of boys who have played, and it'll be good for some of the lads who haven't played, maybe at Parkhead before, I mean, it'll, it's, it's a new experience for them. But I'm sure, obviously, all the older lads and everything will get them through. You personally had an excellent season last year. To what extent do you think you've really continued that this season, and, and why? I don't know, just obviously getting a run in, still playing every week, just enjoying playing football really. I mean, you can't ask for much more than that. If you're playing, just be happy that you're playing and go out there and try to do your best. Do you feel it's a stronger squad that's pushed you on? Yeah, maybe. Obviously, every season there's always a couple of players fighting for each position, you know. But if you can get your nose in there and then hopefully stay ahead and keep putting in the performances, then you'll stay in the team. You ended any uncertainty over your future at the end of last season by signing a new long-term contract. Do you still feel this is the place that can give you the, the best development? Yeah, definitely. I mean, obviously, I w wouldn't have signed the contract for the length that I signed it for. Otherwise, you know, it's obviously it's a great club to be at and yeah. obviously play football. I know we've obviously you know, been through the first quarter of the season, but have you noticed a lot of... Or a noticeable change under Richie compared to you know John Hughes. I mean, it was it something that was? Do you feel you know you maybe don't necessarily notice the change? It's been more gradual. I would say it's been gradual. Obviously, it's a lot of the same players. There's some some different players. Maybe not as much playing out from the back or whatever. But we're obviously still interested in getting the ball down and playing football the right way. And obviously, trying to get forward and score goals. Just trying to make it exciting for everyone.